Just a few months ago, the beauty of these Colorado mountains pulsed with a new beat. The sound of 70. After seeing the 1970 GTX and other new Belvedere models, those quiet mountains may never be the same. The Belvedere line is everything from supercar performance to supermarket efficiency and economy. GTX is offered in swinging two-door hardtop. Sport Satellite has a two-door hardtop, a four-door sedan, and two and three-seat wagons. Satellite has a two-door hardtop, convertible, four-door sedan, and two and three-seat wagons. The groovy Roadrunner continues with two-door hardtop, convertible, and drag favorite, the two-door coupe. Belvedere with V8 or 6 is offered in two-door coupe, four-door sedan, and two-seat station wagon. That's four two-door hardtops, two converts, two two-door coupes, three four-door sedans, and five wagons. That's a full line. For some closer looks, new for 1970 is this bright vertical bar grill on Roadrunner, Satellite, and Belvedere. Those bumper guards are standard across the board on all the new Plymouth Belvedere's. And this bold new black honeycomb grill identifies GTX and Sport Satellite. There are new horizontal tail lights and rear deck trim on all Belvedere's. This is Satellite. As further distinction between models, dual stack tail lights are featured on GTX, Sport Satellite, and Roadrunner. Additional identification for GTX is the black paint treatment. Satellite features silver applique treatment between taillights. Special scotch light reflective tape striping gives GTX instant identification. All two doors have these new simulated air scoops on the rear quarter. Now, open that door. There's an irresistible invitation. New styling with functional design, with a place for everything. New performance-styled instrument panel for GTX and Roadrunner has the look and efficiency of a supercar. Belvedere and Satellite are highlighted by this fully instrumented control panel, which is both practical and beautiful. New bucket seats with integral head restraints provide full support, luxurious comfort, and minimum interference with rearward visibility. Foam cushions are standard in all models. New seat back latches are easy to release with toe pedal. 160 position seat adjuster for maximum driver comfort is optional. The new ignition lock is on the steering column. It also locks the steering wheel. A warning buzzer reminds the driver to take his key with him. Standard lane changer turn signal provides new safety on expressways. Slight pressure on the lever and following traffic gets your message. The optional center console with bucket seats is useful as well as beautiful. Another convenience is the recessed rotary glove box latch, keeping the lid from opening unexpectedly. Wood-grained vinyl inserts add luxury to GTX and Sport Satellite. Optional power window controls are recessed. Even the movies are exciting when you go there in a GTX. And what about Roadrunner? The car of the year in 69, the car to catch in 70. Whatever your bag, in performance and competition, Roadrunner lives up to its name. A new Roadrunner option is a dust swirl tape stripe, adding new identification to America's most exciting car. But it's under the hood. That's what makes a supercar. Standard Roadrunner engine is the 383 four-barrel at 335 horsepower. GTX gets the big 440 four-barrel with 375 horsepower, standard. This 440 cube sizzler with three two-barrel holly carbs to deliver 390 horsepower is optional on GTX and Roadrunner. The greatest engine option, the Hemi, 426 cubes. 425 horses. The air grabber is standard with a Hemi and optional with a 440. Vacuum operated, the air grabber sends cooler, denser air into the carbs, and cooler air gives you a more powerful charge. 
For fast warm-ups, the air grabber remains closed. At the economy end, the famed 225 slant six at 145 horsepower is the standard six on satellite and Belvedere. The 318 at 230 horsepower is the standard V8 on sports satellite, satellite, and Belvedere. Optional V8s include the 383 two barrel at 290 horsepower, the 383 four barrel at 330 horsepower, and with manual transmission, a 383 four barrel at 335 horsepower. The standard GTX transmission is torque flight. The four speed floor shift is standard on Roadrunner. All other models have the new fully synchronized three speed manual with torque flight in the four speed box as options. New pistol grip shifter is standard with a four-speed transmission, making easy work of upshifts and downshifts. There are five high-performance axle packages for 1970. In every case, chassis and suspension are beefed up. With a Hemi suspension, heavy-duty torsion bar front springs, heavy-duty leaf rear springs, heavy-duty shocks, and anti-sway bar. Plymouth data book pages describe the components of each high performance package to help buyers decide how hot they want their 1970 mid-size Plymouth. Tires on all Belvedere's are fiberglass belted for greater strength, longer life, less rolling resistance, and better fuel economy. For those who don't dig performance, and there are folks like that, Plymouth's mid-size lineup provides comfort, handling ease, downright carefree motoring. Station wagon buyers get big 11-inch brakes for added safety and two noteworthy trim options. The sport satellite wagon offers bucket seats and premium cloth and vinyl bench seats with folding center armrest. In addition, Belvedere has all the big car options, power brakes, including power disc brakes, power steering, torque flight, all-weather air conditioning, even automatic speed control. Music lovers can choose from AM FM solid state radio, the magnificent stereo tape player with AM radio, or the instant on solid state AM radio. For dress up, wire wheel covers, one of three wheel cover options with 74 actual spokes. These are so real, an expert will look twice. New optional 14 or 15 inch rally road wheels will turn on the flat out set. Mix in five new now performance colors. Limelight, vitamin C, lemon twist, in violet, and tor red. Put that all together and you can please any prospect for a mid-sized car. Remember too, in every driving situation, the Plymouth buyer gets the stability of torsion bar front suspension and the security of unibody all-welded construction. All of it protected by seven-step dip and spray anti-rust treatments and super hard acrylic enamel, working to keep the showroom shine and beauty long after delivery. Yes, Colorado's peaceful beauty may never be the same. There's temptation to suggest that anyone you slide behind the wheel of a 1970 Belvedere may never be satisfied until he owns one. And Plymouth makes it.